Hello, today I'll be showing you my CD collection. As of now, I have three bookshelves of CDs, but for this video, I'll just be focusing on the first bookshelf. But yeah, recently I surpassed 1,500 CDs, and there, right now there isn't really any CDs that I want or need at the moment. I have pretty much everything that I need. But before I dive into the CDs, let me show you what we have on top of the bookshelf. Starting with all of my box sets right here. Then we got some more stuff up here. Queensryche, Operation Live Crime, Aerosmith, Pandora's Box, Genesis, Archives. Uh, that's a two or three disc compilation thing. And then we have Tool Survival right there. And then right here we have all of my VIP laminates and guitar picks. Now, going into the CDs, we're gonna start off with 311. Those are all of my 311 CDs. My copy of Voyager is signed. The CD booklet is signed. Then we got 50 Cent. And then we have Acid Bath. I have the two albums and the demos compilation. And then we have Aerosmith, one of my favorite bands. I do have a lot of their stuff. I also have this long box, Leatherbound Limited Edition long box of Pump. Definitely really cool to get. I got that from um, a record store in Seattle, Silver Platters, if I remember correctly. But after them, we have Alice in Chains. Then we got All That Remains. My copy of Victim of the New Disease comes with a signed CD booklet. Then we got Annihilator. Those are some of my Annihilator CDs. Moving to the next shelf, we have the rest of the Annihilator CDs. My copy of Metal 2 comes with a signed postcard, signed by Jeff Waters. And then we have Anthrax. And with Anthrax, my copy of For All Kings is signed. And my copy of XL is also signed. I got them signed when I saw them live back in January and did VIP. Then we got Arch Enemy. My copy of Deceivers comes with a postcard signed by the band. Then we got As I Lay Dying. Then we got At the Gates, Avenged Sevenfold, Beastie Boys, Beck, and then some of my Biohazard CDs. Moving to the next shelf, the rest of my Biohazard CDs. I also have the Black Panther soundtrack, the first movie. Then we got Black Sabbath, which is the band that's playing in the background right now. Also, this Black Sabbath CD, limited to 300 copies. Mine is number 34. Then we got Blink-182, Breaking Benjamin, and my copy of Ember is signed. I got it from the band's website when the album was coming out. Then we got both from our Valentine. My copy of Fever is signed. I got that from a record store. And my copy of the self-titled is also signed. I got that from the band's uh, online store. Then we got Bush. My copy of Artist Survival is signed by Gavin. Then we got Candlemass, Cavalier Conspiracy, and then some of my Corrosion of Conformity CDs. Next shelf is the rest of my Corrosion of Conformity CDs. I also have this CD here, which is definitely not easy to find. Then we got Cradle of Filth, The Cult, Dead by Sunrise, Dark Angel, Dark Tranquility, Death, Death Angel, and with Death Angel, my copy of Evil Divide is signed, and my copy of Humanicide is signed. That happened when I did VIP for them back in May when I saw them live. I saw them live with Creator and Sepultura. Then we got Def Leppard right here. Next shelf, we have Def Leppard's Diamond Star Halos. Then we got Deftones, and my copy of Ohms comes with a signed CD booklet. Then we got Disturbed. Then we got Down. When it comes to their first two albums, my copies are for promotional use only. 
And then we got Dream Theater. I do have Distance Over Time and A View from the Top of the World, but those are art, those are art books, so you're gonna have to wait to see those in the next CD collection video that I do after this one, because I have those somewhere else. And then we got Eminem, Faith No More, one of my personal favorite bands, Fall Out Boy, more of a fan of their early, early work than their later work, but it is what it is. Then we got Fate's Warning, some of my CDs from them. Next shelf, we have the rest of my Fate's Warning CDs. And then we got Fear Factory. When it comes to this CD, I didn't know, when I was getting this in the mail from eBay, I didn't know it was gonna be signed, but pretty cool though. And then my copy of Genexus comes with a signed CD booklet. And then we got Fight, Filter, another pretty good band. They're coming out with a new album uh, this month, which should definitely be really cool. Then we got Fleetwood Mac, Garbage, Genesis, and at the end of this bookshelf, we have Godsmack. I got all of their main studio albums and I have the other side EP. Moving on, we have Good Charlotte. My copy of Generation RX comes with a CSI and CD booklet. Then we got Grey Days, then we got Helmet, and Flames, and my copy of Forgone comes with a signed postcard. Then we got Incubus, a band that I saw recently, that was my last concert. Then we got Iron Maiden, then after Iron Maiden we have J. Cole, after J. Cole we got Jane's Addiction, and then we have... Judas Priest, Rockerola. Moving to the next shelf is the rest of my Judas Priest CDs. And also my copy of Demolition is for promotional use only. And then after Judas Priest, we got Kendrick Lamar, my favorite rapper. And then we have Killswitch Engage, my copy of Atonement comes with a signed CD booklet. And then we got King Crimson. King's X, one of the most underrated bands of all time. If you haven't heard of them, please check them out. I can't recommend them enough. Then we got Corn, some of my Corn CDs. Now the last shelf here for this bookshelf is the rest of my Corn CDs. Uh, my copy of Requiem is signed. I got that from the UK version of Amazon actually. And I do have Requiem Mass. And then next after Corn, we got Creator. Uh, when it comes to Hate Uber Alice, I got my copy signed when I did VIP. And then we got Lacuna Coil, pretty good band. Um, Karma Code's my favorite. And then we got Led Zeppelin. Then we got Life of Agony, Limp Biscuit, and finally, Linkin Park, some of my Linkin Park CDs. But that's it for this bookshelf. Let me know your thoughts. Do you have any of these CDs and all the good stuff? But anyways, thanks for watching. Please leave a comment to like, subscribe. Have a nice day and take care.